Hello and welcome. In this quick video, I'll demonstrate how you can use Spiffy Inspire to empower your Kubernetes workloads with the capability to mutually authenticate each other and communicate securely. Let's go over the two workloads we'll use in this demo. The first workload is the Hello service. The Hello service is a simple gRPC server served over mutually authenticated TLS. The X509 service identity and the X509 routes used to authenticate callers are provided and automatically rotated by the Spiffy Workload API. The service authorizes the caller only if it is an authenticated member of the example.org trust domain. Next up, we've got the World service. The World service is a client of the Hello service. Like the Hello service, it obtains automatically rotated service identity and X509 routes from the Spiffy Workload API and establishes mutually authenticated TLS with the Hello service. The World service only authorizes the peer if it presents the proper Hello service Spiffy ID. Now that we've described our workloads, let's get our cluster set up and our workloads deployed. First, we'll start by deploying a pristine kind cluster. Now we'll deploy Spire. Next, we'll build and load our workload images into our kind control plane. Next, we want to deploy our workloads, but before we can do that, we need to assign them their respective service identities. By default, Spire will assign workloads an identity based on their namespace and service account. Today, however, we're going to use a pod annotation to declare the workload service identity for each pod. With our workload service identity assigned, we can now deploy our workloads and verify their status. With our workloads both ready, let's check out the logs from the Hello service. We can see that the Hello service used the workload API to obtain its X509 service identity, started listening for incoming requests, and received a few from the world service. And likewise, if we look at the logs from the world service, we can see that it also uses the workload API to obtain its X509 service identity, dialed the hello service, made a few requests, and got back some replies. And there you have it, mutually authenticated service-to-service -service communication powered by Spiffy Inspire. Thanks for watching.